Ah, it's time to talk about the few questions that is a very important question I used to hear that is uh, and I also used to suggest to my student that is uh, who is the entrepreneur within you? See, there is a uh, many type of entrepreneurs. Okay, so to generalize, I, I put them in three categories. One is uh, a struggler. One is a lifestyle, which is very popular these days. And another one is a magician. See, the struggler, the which kind of uh, entrepreneurs are kind of a struggler? Most of all, the people who come in with the kind of consultancy formula, this kind of um, uh, company, they used to struggle. Because why is it struggling? Because they uh, every month they're having a target to find one customer to another customer to another customer. And every day it's the same hassle. Okay, so if you are running a such kind of business model where you, where you have to, um, you are still having the same problem every day to find the customers, I think you're going through the serious business problem. You need to look uh, look into a business model and your business again, and as well as your business ideas. Okay, so think about it. Secondly, is a lifestyle entrepreneurs. Uh, at one stage, the lifestyle entrepreneurs are succeeded thanks to the internet okay and uh, there are many great example in front of us some people are running blog video blog uh, some people are writing a books yes there are many many different kind of lifestyle entrepreneurs or you maybe get hooked by by the formula of retirement in as the age of 40 years honestly speaking this doesn't exist actually okay this is just a hype this is just the marketing tricks okay so what i like to emphasize here you may be not agree with me that's all right but if you want to try you can try and you will you will know it actually or the people who are already doing it just go and ask them the biggest uh, the philosopher of uh, retirement at 40 this is uh, tom ferris i think probably if you got the chance to meet him you can ask him if it is how true it is okay so so the uh, lifestyle is uh, entrepreneurship is coming with their own limitations like you can you can build something but again for example you build a great blog okay so now you got the pressure to you to do something every day in your blog writing article um, reply to the people you have to be there all the time and if any business which is which is required your presence to operate this is not good business okay and this is not sustainable and scalable business and business that can be good business but that is not sustainable and scalable okay you got it what i mean what i want to say okay so a third point i like to focus this is a magician magician uh, uh, entrepreneurs are are those entrepreneurs who attract people who attract crowd for example you're solving a problems okay you're solving a great problems so you don't have to search people who are in a problem and give them a solution when you having a great solution of a great problem big problem the people will come towards you okay that's the magic of magician okay so you choose between which kind of um stream which kind of entrepreneur would like to be okay uh, second um thing i like to focus that entrepreneurship require a great hard job doesn't matter some people can tell you it's so easy you can do that over the night i earn one million in one month it's all fake honestly it's all fake why so because they're trying to uh, sell you that how easy it is and they know something by by the inherited meaning is that if it looks easy you will go for it you will buy their proposal okay if it's look hard psychologically we are not prepared to buy it okay so that's the logic behind it okay there is a no successful business is easy all the businesses all the startups is hard you have to work hard to get your result all right so don't be get fooled by the marketing stuff of other people okay choose between the happiness and the glory okay when uh, see the happiness of a short term and glory and happiness of uh, long term okay so it's, it's very important for example uh, with the video bloggers or with the bloggers you can be a short term you can have kind of free lifestyle you can have uh, free time but for long term it's not going to make you billionaire that for sure okay 
secondly, uh, another point I like to mention here is uh, very critical. That is, uh, never compare your interior with the exterior of other people. Okay, what you see in other people should not make you feel inferior. Okay, the moment you feel inferior, you wish to give up. Okay. And that's not you should that must not you should do as an entrepreneur if you want to be a truly entrepreneur if you want to reach the goal of million, like a multi-million business or a, a billion dollar business you have to learn never to give up and I can promise you if you implement this rule never give up you're going to be a billionaire of tomorrow okay so that's it for now thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next video